When it comes to a stroke, every second counts. One local hospital has received an award for how they handle stroke patients. First News reporter Brandon JCs talked to their chief medical officer to learn how common they are and what they do for a stroke patient when they come to an ER. Strokes are a common condition for emergency rooms to see, and the chief medical officer at Sharon Regional told me that he expects to see at least two stroke patients every shift. Uh, stroke is one of the becoming more and more one of the leading causes of death and certainly disability as people are living to older age, um, and. So we see it really frequently. It's not uncommon for us to have stroke alerts, that, which means everybody get ready, all hands on deck, uh, almost every day in the emergency department. Their efforts for stroke care earned them the American Heart Association's Gold Plus Get With the Guidelines Stroke Quality Achievement Award. Schellenbarger said they've received this award and others like it for a number of years. But as they grow, it gets more and more prestigious. I'm very proud of the team, of the work that everyone has put in from our EMS agency, like I said before. It's, it's so much work. It's so much planning and thoughtfulness and working together and communication that uh, I'm very proud that they were able to do that. He said it's important to know the signs of a stroke for yourself or a loved one. They include drooping face, not being able to move your arm, and trouble speaking. Atrial fibrillation or a hole in your heart can also put people of all ages at risk for a stroke. He also said timing is everything when it comes to a stroke. The sooner it can be treated, the better. In Sharon for WKBN 27 First News, I'm Brandon Jaycees.